then supposedly that the last person already is going down, yeah? Now, that the last person have to be, this is the rappel side. Okay. And this is the... Do you want the rappel side always to be on the quick link side? Or does that yeah. matter? Yeah, no. Yes, it have to be in the quick link. Quick link, okay. Why? Because the last person who is doing is this. Is making a knot. You can do like no. And that is the reason that I left the equipment in the rappel side. Okay. Then the last person is doing this. Part when I was lifting, it was a grove. There's a rock? Grove. Grove in the rock. Okay. Like groves? Group. Yep. Group. Okay. Then, when I was going through, it went through the grove because of the knot. And it get pinched the other step. Then, the whole system cuts. Yeah. What about? And it's not coming up. <laughs> because the grub is just here. Then if it's here, with the pressure, it's not going to So any groove in the rock can cause it okay. to catch and not fail. So yeah. if, if the slope is nice and smooth, this will work. But if it has a crack or something that could get in there, it could uh -huh. be. So stuck. this is where it got stuck. Yeah, that, that is where I, I take a picture where it got stuck. And so, that is what happened. So if you're repelling off of two, is everybody repelling off of two lines anyway? Yeah, I, I didn't. So why not preset your knot? I can do it two, in two lines in one line. It's okay. Yeah, I didn't do it. Okay. But, but so, so if the issue is on the pole with the knot coming up from the bottom, why yeah. wouldn't you preset your knot at the top if you're repelling off both lines anyway? Uh -huh. Or preset a block between these two that you can pull. Yeah, right. But, but if you put there, then this, you are leaving the wheel on top. Not necessarily. What because if you so what if you so if you're repelling off both lines uh -huh. and you've got a block right here, and all of a sudden you pull on this line, this line now has no knot in it, so it should clear. Uh -huh. You've got a block here to pull your carabiner and pull everything else down. Yeah, that is, that is, that is, that is more or less the solution. Yeah. That I will be showing sure with the other setup. Okay. okay. Then we are going to change the setup, okay? This is the main way to do it. Now, the other way that we have been working like with Matt, with Dave, with Gustavo, is using micro uh, macro mate mm -hmm. and we are using also um seal then in this case we are going to put here seal okay. here right here What is the advantage of this configuration? We are repelling here in this line. And that will be our pull side here. Mm -hmm. Yes. Now, if we were to retreat, when the last person is down, we just and we move this one. If for some reason it gets stuck, suppose the that I get stuck. The only thing that we can do is retrieve our rope and we lose that We lose the carabiner, the quick link, and the weapon. Yeah, but in the previous one, it was everything. Everything. Yeah. 
Because the road gets get a road map. But in this one, in this configuration, if it works perfect, if this works perfect, all is gone. Now, that is one way to do it. The other way to do it, as long as you trust the CEM or the macrame or whatever. Yeah. Everybody has to trust that. Why, why yeah. would you have a carabiner up there and not